The following segment is sponsored by Intermountain Healthcare and the Utah Department of Health. Millions of Americans have chronic lower back pain, and Jeffrey Beck here is an exercise specialist with the Intermountain Medical Center Heart Institute in Murray. And you have some exercises that can help alleviate that pain. That's right. Get rid of it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, it can help with the, yeah alleviating, just or like you said, it. or yeah. preventing it. Yes, and the best way to do that is regular practice of back strengthening and stretching exercises. Okay. So it doesn't have to be too hard. Uh, nope, it doesn't. These okay. are pretty easy. So uh, if you happen to have a pair of dumbbells, now you can use dumbbells for this exercise or some some canned goods. Okay. You're just going to hinge forward from the hips here. We're gonna do an alternating dumbbell row. So we're gonna pull the weight up one side and then the other. Okay, and you're an keeping your back fashion. pretty straight, right? Yep, okay. absolutely. Keep the gaze looking forward, head up, head just up, like good. this. We're gonna do three sets of 10 reps of this. And pretty heavy is okay for that, right? Well, moderate. Like a, like maybe a milk jug. Yeah, milk water. jug okay. would work. Yeah, that's okay. that's a fantastic suggestion. So uh, we're going to do three sets of 10 reps of that, and uh -huh. then we're going to move into what's called the deep squat stretch. So this one, if you do have bad knees, you may want to refrain from doing this, but you're just going to slowly squat down, mm -hmm. and you're just going to hold this here, just like this. And that's stretching that whole yes. the lower yeah, back I and can down into your completely. glutes and into your hamstrings, Yeah, right? I totally feel that kind of releasing that lower back tension. Okay. Just gonna hold this for one minute and then come back to starting okay. position. Do it three times. Okay. That's all you have to do. Easy enough. Easy enough. Just and then stretch. The, the last one we'll do is the back and leg stretch. So this one, we're gonna place our hands behind our back okay. and we're just gonna hinge forward from the hips. Try that. Just like so. And, and keep your knees locked? Yes, you can okay. keep them soft, but okay. uh, typically keep them locked. That way you can feel that stretch in the hamstring that connects into the glutes and then the lower back. But you don't want to hunch over, right? No, just okay, until your upper straight. body's about parallel to the floor. Yep. Okay. Hold and that for 30 seconds and do it three times. And you do that and it's strengthening the muscles so it helps alleviate some of the pain, right? Yes, yeah, strengthening that muscle is key to, to helping alleviate that pain. And, and I've always heard strengthening the abs will help your back. It will, yeah, a strong core is very important okay. as well. All right, some great exercises for you guys. Uh, strengthen that lower back. We do a lot of standing, so uh, mm -hmm. I guess standing around is more what we do. <laughs>